in India, there are people who uh, practice their occult art on trees. You heard of this? They'll practice their occult art. They need some subject to practice on. They'll make the trees actually bleed, red blood coming out. I have seen this with my own eyes. They'll do all kinds of things to the trees. So suppose you happen to take such a tree and cut it, it would be a very tortured tree. If this went into somebody's house, some innocent family not knowing one thing from the other, they could really cause harm to themselves. Usually, in India carpentry is traditionally taught. Now, of course, they're being taught in schools and things. This particular community, which is generally in South India called Acharis, yeah? there they are taught how to feel the wood. how to use the wood. They'll simply reject wood sometimes, they won't take it. Now it's all gone because of commercial reasons, every piece of wood is used and put into everything, okay? And now it's all plywood, you don't know what the hell has gone into it, okay? <laughs> Otherwise, if you went to a traditional achari, he will… Ch if you say, I'm using this for my… let's say for my uh, puja room or my worship room, He'll say, no, this wood I can't do, you get me another wood. <laughs> if he says, this is for my… you know, I'm making a cradle for my child, he say, no, this wood, I won't make it for the child. Like this they'll choose, they'll become experts in, you know, feeling the wood like that. But all that is almost… Uh, I would say more than ninety percent gone, unfortunately. Uh, Twenty, thirty years ago, about thirty years ago, when I was in construction, these things were still on. Now it's like pfft, everything is sliced and packed and put, nobody cares what. It's a very subtle force, only sometimes it's very strong. Otherwise, generally, it's a subtle force. Actually, in many homes, probably women, if, if the women are not… Uh, <laughs> I'm not saying this with any negative, Thing. If they're not pumped up, career-oriented, but they're a little more gentle, they feel the home around. If that kind of women are there, probably they would know where to put what, without actually thinking about it, without, you know, exactly logically deciphering, but they may arrange it in such a way that it is not… it feels good that it doesn't become a negative force in the house. I'm sure a lot of women are sensitive to those things. They may not be conscious about it uh, because uh, I've uh, <laughs> particularly seen an aunt of mine. would uh, spend hours uh, changing positions a little bit like this, little bit like that, little bit like this, till she feels Uh, I'm like that too <laughs> I have to move things all around. It has to be like that because if you're sensitive, all these things are real for you. So, life is many, 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 many dimensions. How much are you willing to explore? That rich your life is. Whether you cook or you do carpentry, or you sweep the floor, there are a million ways to do the same thing, yes? There are a million different ways to do the same thing. It's not the same thing in everybody's hands, isn't it? Hmm? It is not the same thing. So, if you do not pay attention, nothing… nothing is there, everything is stone and mud only. If you pay attention, everything becomes something else. How much attention? How keen is your attention? How much attention do you think life deserves? 
<laughs> that's a big question how much attention do you think life deserves how much everything that you have isn't it if you pay attention everything is exotic everything is fabulous everything is magnificent everything is a doorway to the divine if you don't pay attention everything is just stone and mud this is not a spiritually significant place but it's of occult significance that may not be very attractive or palatable and with their own bare teeth they lock into the neck of the animal and just drink the blood people can cause immense damage to themselves by taking something like this into their house there is a whole cult like this in india the snake pig can be programmed to go and bite that person 